John Wellington Wells. I'm a dealer in magic and spells, in blessings and curses and ever-filled purses, in prophecies, witches and nails. If you want a proud photo, make tracks. If you'd melt every jungle in wax, you've got to look in on our resident gin number 70, Simmery Axe. We've a first-rate assortment of magic and for raising a posthumous shade. With effects that are comic or tragic, there's no cheaper house in the trade. Love filters with quantities of it and for knowledge if anyone burns. We keep in a very small profit, a profit who brings us unbounded returns. For it can prophesy with a wink of his eye, people security, into futurity, some of your history, clear of a mystery, humor, proclivity, foreign nativity, foreign nativity. He has answers oracular, bogus, spectacular, tetrapods, tradical, mirrors, some magical, facts, astronomical, solemn or comical. And if you want it, it makes a reduction on taking a quantity. Oh, if anyone anything lacks, he'll find it already in stacks. If he'd only look in on the resident gin number 70, Simriax. <laughs> can raise you hosts of ghosts, and that without reflectors, and creepy things with wings, and gaunt and grisly specters. He can fill you crowds of shrouds, and horrify you vastly. He can wreck your brains with chains, and gibberings grim and gah! Then if you planity changes organity with an urbanity full of satanity, vexes humanity with an inanity fatal to vanity, driving your foes to the verge of insanity. Barring tautology, in demonology, electrobiology, mystrognosology, spirit philology, hydrostology, such as his knowledge, he isn't a man to require an apology. Oh, my name is John Wellington Wells. I'm a dealer in magic and spells, in blessings and curses, in ever-filled purses, in prophecies, witches and nails. And if anyone anything lacks, he'll find it already in stacks, if he only Look in on the resident gene number 70 Simriax.